एज अ साइकोलॉजिस्ट और अ थेरेपिस्ट हाउ इंपॉर्टेंट डू यू थिंक इट इज टू हेल्प द क्लाइंट डिफाइन देयर आउटकम दैट दे विश टू अचीव फ्रॉम थेरेपी इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इज इंट इट बट वाई इज इट सो इंपॉर्टेंट लेट इज एक्सप्लोर द आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन इन दिस वीडियो बट बिफोर दैट go ahead and subscribe to this channel so that we can share more valuable resources that will help you develop powerful therapeutic skills now there are many reasons why setting an outcome in therapy is very important here are top 5 according to me first it is the primary reason for the client to continue with subsequent sessions imagine going to a person who asks you to meet them let's say every week without you being asked what will you like to achieve during these meetings how motivated would you be to go for these sessions the same applies to your clients second clearly defined outcomes help you develop rapport and create a strong therapeutic alliance both of these are very important for the client to support you during the therapeutic process and i am sure You already understand that to be able to support your client effectively you need the client to support you during the process third the outcome or the goal gives the session a sense of direction and guides the therapist in creating a therapy plan imagine trying to create a plan to meet someone without really knowing where to meet how do you create a plan for that the same applies in therapy now you may say that i can plan along the way and you're right you can if it was just about you and your life but would you really like to do that with your client especially when you can just ask the client what they want to achieve it is a lot more easier and a lot more efficient fourth a well defined outcome provides a clear indicator for both the client and the therapist to measure the effectiveness of therapy Imagine hiring a person for a job who does not know what is the job that they are supposed to do. Now, at the end of the month, you want them to show to you how effective were they in their job. If they don't know what was the job that they were supposed to do or what you expected from them, how likely are they to show the effectiveness? Not much, right? When a therapist tries to work with a client without knowing what the outcome is, it is like being hired to do a job without knowing what the job is. Even if you have done an amazing job, the client is really no way of measuring the effectiveness in the long run. Yes, they may feel good as a result of the work you have done together, but then they can feel good while watching a movie or in some cases even watching porn. Momentarily feeling good is not really a reliable indicator. for effectiveness of therapy but the client having achieved a clearly defined goal is isn't it and lastly goals help you understand when it's time to end the sessions that the client is having with you without goals or outcomes therapy can literally become like a never ending process because neither you nor the client is sure what was the purpose of the therapy in the first place so you don't even know whether the purpose of therapy is achieved or not and if you don't know that how do you end the session now these are the top 5 reasons according to me you tell me are these reasons important enough for us to focus on setting goals or outcomes in therapy do share your answer as yes or no in the comments below are there other reasons that you can think of about why we should focus on setting goals or outcomes in therapy do share them in the comments with us as well in the end i would like you to remember that knowing the outcome that one needs to achieve for therapy is a lot like knowing what fruit you want to grow in a garden everything from the seed you will plant to the type of nurturing you will provide to the seed and how much time you need to nurture the seed and the plant before it can relatively sustain itself depends on knowing about the fruit in advance now that you know the importance of goal setting in therapy 
in the next video we will focus on exploring what is an effective outcome really and what are the key factors we need to keep in mind when helping clients define their desired outcomes if you would like to be notified about the next videos do watch this space and follow us i would also request you to join us in this mission to help mental health practitioners develop advanced therapeutic skills you can do so by liking this video and commenting on it along with sharing it with your friends with your colleagues and in your circles